So, 18 kills not only his mother, but his brother as well. Like, subscribe, ID in the Discovery Channel. Yes, ID in the Discovery Channel. The links are provided below. Get that Discovery Go app as well as that ID Go app. You might want to get those two things, combine them, make them into one. And I'm a Discovery Influencer. That's indeed the truth. So, Levi Norwood. 17 years old from virginia levi norwood yes was charged in the killing of his six-year-old brother and his 34-year-old mother again norwood was charged with two counts of murder after he was apprehended in north carolina norwood used a gun to act out his acts of killing murdering his mother and brother and where it took place was within the family's home what would make a what would make a 17 year old want to kill because see when i started to the, the story pertaining to him being 17 years old and his mother she was 34 years old that's quite young calculate the age difference in that sort of thing that's to say she had him very young right uh, i'm gonna get back to that the, the reason norwood was arrested they were looking for him but the reason he was arrested by police in the first place was for reasons of him being accused of shop shoplifting he, he was in fact arrested because he to be in a store shoplifting as I say somebody's gonna call police on you with that sort of thing right uh, Norwood's father was the individual who found his wife and young son dead within the family home it, it was yes his father who found them like that right right after levi himself turned the gun on his father shooting his father but not killing his father the father escaped he he in fact ran and yelled for help right what, what could have possibly dear viewers what could have possibly been going on in this household because see one of levi's friends stated something about abuse but he didn't clearly state if there was abuse going on fully in a in a home more than likely more details as time goes on the details will play out later as yeah everything adds up what will, will happen because to have a friend say that there was some type of abuse but he didn't fully say if it was within the home or if it was the father doing the beating or if it was the mother doing any type of beating or Levi himself or something. It's not clearly stated on it completely if there was abuse. Friend uh, of Levi stated Levi was known to have anger issues at times, right? I'm just was I'm wondering what would make a 17 year old not only kill his 34 year old mother but more than anything his six year old brother what could a six year old have did that was so wrong to a 17 year old brother it, it don't even make sense sheriffs thought Norwood had barricaded himself within the home when they got there he was nowhere to be found upon them entering the premises yeah because see a 17 year old 17 year olds they oftentimes do things act up whatever else right but in them doing stuff like that uh, say acting out whatever right you would think a 17 year old if there's an issue with the mother so, something must have taken place with him having a dislike for the mother or something right enough for him to take her life but usually if there's some argument disagreement within the home 
uh, oftentimes a 17 year old is not going to say take a six year old's life if that makes sense that's why I'm asking what, what could the six year old have did that was so bad what would make a six year old yeah usually little brothers they, they might usually it's older brothers that pick on little brothers and not the other way around younger brothers I, I can see there must have been some issue with his his mother or something within that household that must not have been right because to know that he not only took the mother and the son but he also tried to take the father's life is to say something was really wrong there either in the household or the 17 year old has some mental issues or something right helicopters drones and bloodhounds were used in the search for him looking for him that's him right there after norwood was found it was the sheriff's office who stated they didn't know what type of gun was used and didn't know norwood's motive it's been also stated by the sheriff's office that guns were stored within the family's home and it isn't fully known if those guns were used in the shooting and or if any of the guns are missing or were missing are missing right it, once again it's not known if he had any type of behavioral issues consider his age any type of that's high school graduation age leaving out of high school or already out of high school right behavioral issues consider teens go through all type of stuff experimenting with drugs using drugs right hormonal things that go on with teenagers at the age of 17 right that can have an effect on behavioral uh yes behavior as well right so once again it's not known if he had any mental issue or psychological issues but a friend of norwood stated that at times norwood would be uh angry there, there was in fact a friend that went to touch norwood levi i keep saying norwood either way right uh a friend indeed touched his hair after he dyed his hair and yeah levi went off about that he got angry um yeah because you want to question was anything not right going down in the house anytime there's some type of situation where a teen tries to murder his whole family as i say something is is completely wrong with the picture within the four walls of the house or were right something because what what i mean i'm saying this because he could have went out in the streets and shot anybody else or killed anybody else you see what i'm saying he could have had even um well that was a little bit i'm thinking too forward on that when i said he could have went and shot the guy that accused or the guy or the woman that accused him of shoplifting he could have went but that's too ahead because to know that he was indeed found over that is to say right see how forward my brain jumps right because to know once again the police found him after he was accused of shoplifting as to say even that could have played out say if the police would have never i'm stepping to a hit of time and thinking but let me just use that for an example say if if he would have gotten away right But even not that far, could he or could he have not, say if if 
police were out looking for him or something say his face showing up on the news or something like that would he have kept running if say police uh showed his face somewhere where he's seen it maybe on a tv screen or somewhere or anything like that and say he went back and shot and killed the store owner or whoever accused him of shoplifting right all i'm trying to say is he could have killed anyone he could have killed any numerous of people in this situation ordeal matter right in place of his his uh mother Because you can try to think of all the reasons. Well, why wouldn't he not kill anybody else? I mean, to know that school shootings are going on, right? You, you got people out here that's out here shooting up schools. People are robbing banks. He could have, if he really wanted to kill him, saying he could have went in the bank and shot and killed somebody and walked out, right? There's all type of things. And yet to know that the problem surrounded within that household is to say that there's more that even he's not telling hopefully there was no child abuse or anything growing up within the home because even that is enough to make kids grow up with issues or whatever and then next thing you know they start killing people in the home once they're old enough to do so I'm saying sometimes you have molestation that goes on in homes. Sometimes you have abuse by even mothers that goes on within homes. And then once a kid is grown enough and old enough to do so, that's how lives can be taken. I think that's all to be said on that. There's really uh, no more angles. And, yeah, and two, if the problem, see, you have to look at where the problem stems, as in where it begins and end pertaining to reason and logic and all the rest. If he really had an issue, say the father was part of the problem, he would have killed the father first, I'm thinking. He would have picked the right day, right, and killed the father in place of the mother. So I'm wondering what could have been so bad between the mother and the son. Or was he just one of those angry type of teens that felt like at that moment I can do what I do. When teens act, act tough, well, I'm going to do what I do. I'm able to see how even that was a possibility of playing out. Say he was just in one of his mad mood swing fits of being angry like his friend stated right and say he he, he might have been walking through the house or something and say it say the mother said something that aggravated him he may or may not have wanted to take her life right she might have just stood in his way by aggravating him and he possibly just was just real angry livid over over whatever right and just shot and killed her and killed the son as well that's a possibility too as in there may or may not have been something wrong within the household completely maybe he just was one of those angry people that couldn't control his anger or temper or something and just shot as he chose let me pick and choose who i'm gonna shoot because i'm mad for the day and i just don't even care about if mama is dead or if brother is dead right because i can't control my temper or something situations can play like that as well as and they can play out like that so i think that's all to be said for now with that but we're on investigation discovery uh dot com the id logo is in the far left corner right there live now is betrayed yeah there's so many ways you can try to make sense of his story how many teenagers, how many of us have been known to go through angry uh, spills and disputes with others, right? Then somebody come and stand in your way and you just real angry or upset about something. A person like me will possibly push them out the way, but some other people 
will pick up a gun or something. New episodes. The only way I can see it, the father, uh, say has something. Remember, he shot the father last, right? Only way I can see if the father has something to do with it or something like that pertaining to say child abuse or child molestation is if if say the father did something like that and the mother covered it for years. That's enough too to make a a child want to kill the mother before the father. You, you can see it at every angle. If my, if a person's father molest a boy at a young age or abuses a boy at a young age right that's to say once again oftentimes mothers try to hide that sort of thing from out in public out away from family right mothers are known to keep secrets hide it right if a, if a father is touching on a son or both sons or say the older son right uh, that would in fact lead to animosity between that older animosity between that older child towards his mother for keeping a secret like that right even if it's abuse that was going on and say it didn't happen in childhood it was happening before he killed her right say if the father was abusing any one of them in that home the mother the little brother even the older brother right mothers are known to keep secrets away from public right family members and all that to keep it away right that's enough too to make a 17 year old uh take a life as well because he will have bitterness towards that mother and yet it's something more what else could there have been yeah you don't always during if it's abuse sometimes you don't always kill the abuser sometimes you can kill the person that was keeping secrets or something such as a mother if the father is doing abusing or something i'm just i'm keep pinpointing that because that's what one of the friends said was about they moved or something like that and it was questions of abuse right Sometimes you would kill the person that could be keeping the secret, such as your mother, and not kill the abuser, which could be your father. Because, yeah, you would have some type of animosity or bitterness towards your mother because she didn't stop the abuses while you would do the killing. That, that makes sense. It completely does so once again we're on investigation discovery uh new episodes to receive an audio visual preview is a click the play button right here unlocked episodes same thing audio visual preview unlock series recommended for you shouts out to lieutenant joe kenda as well as paula id go original series it's descriptive crime feed crime feed news to gain access to the crime feed is to go to www.crimefeed.com no spaces in between uh to receive a newsletter is to type your email address in and click next. I'm indeed sitting on the next button. Yeah, because I, I can't see any other way. Somebody his age would have went anywhere out in public and go to shooting. So that's to say seeming he did not do that sort of thing is something personal. Some people might say, well, school shootings uh, is personal. Yeah, you got some people that shoot up schools just to shoot them up, right? Uh, but more than likely, family secrets or something is in on this one. So I think that's all to be said for now. Dear viewers, enjoy your day. I will indeed enjoy mine, and I'm gone.